BCA test 2, question number 23. Calculate the following. Something over 2 plus 3 over 4 plus 5 equals 1 plus 2 over 3 plus 4. Now, first of all, we rewrite this um, without the pluses. We add the numbers first. So I can rewrite it as something, question mark, over 2 plus 3 over 4 plus 5 is 9. So 3 over 9 equals 1 plus 2 over 3 plus 4 is 7. Now, 3 over 9 can be simplified. 3 divided by 3 is 1. 9 divided by 3 is 3. So you basically have something over 2 plus 1 third. As we said before, always change um, added fractions or mixed numbers into improper fractions. So 2 plus 1 third is the same as saying 2 and 1 third. So 2 times 3 is 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. So it becomes 7 over 3 equals 1 plus 2 over 7. Actually, I can write 1 plus 2 over 7 as a mixed number, 1 and 2 sevenths. So right away, it's 1 times 7, 7, plus 2, 9, 9 over 7 as, a, as an improper fraction. Now, keep the question mark on the left-hand side equals 9 over 7 as it is on the right-hand side. Now I want to move the 7 over 3 from here and bring it to the right-hand side of the equation. When we move a fraction, remember every numerator becomes a denominator and vice versa. But that is if the fraction was itself multiplied by a denominator, if it was on top, next to the question mark. But here, 7 over 3 as one whole fraction, as one whole thing, is considered a denominator. So it goes to the right-hand side, multiplied. So it's like saying question mark divided by x. It goes to the other side as times x. So 7 over 3 is my x that I'm talking about. So it goes up as 7 over 3, not 3 over 7. We don't take the reciprocal this time because we are taking the whole fraction as it is to the other side of the equation. Now here 7 and 7 are going to cancel out. 3 divided by 3 is 1. 9 divided by 3 is 3. So your answer is going to be E3. Okay, now let's move on to another question from BCA test 4, question number 35. Which of the following is equal to the square root of 1%? Now remember, percent means over 100. So 1% 1 is 1 over 100. So the square root of 1% is the same as saying the square root of 1 over 100. Now remember, when we have a fraction, two numbers divided by each other, or two numbers multiplied by each other under a square root, we can rewrite this as two square roots multiplied or divided by each other, depending on what is under the original square root. So the square root over of 1 over 100 is the same as the square root of 1 over the square root of 100. Square root of 1 is 1, square root of 100 is 10. Okay, because we're they're all positive answers, so we're not going to take the negative um, answer to the square root. So it's just 1 tenth. Now, if you look at the answer choices, all the answer choices are in percent themselves. So you need to ask yourself, what is 1 over 10? 1 over 10 is 10 percent. How do we know? If you want to find 1 over 10 in percents, what do we do? Remember? we multiply up and down by something to give me something over 100 because that's percent. So if you multiply by 10, 10 times 10 gives you 100. So I multiply up here by 10, 1 times 10 gives me 10. So 10 over 100 means 10 percent. So the answer will be D.